Hello beauties, it's me Tony, and today's video is going to be another unboxing, but this unboxing is basically going to be uh, a contemporary brand, Coach. So I know everyone knows about Coach. Everyone had like the little bitty purses in high school and that sort of thing. And um, Coach has really just been like stepping up his game, I guess, as far as the luxury fan base. Uh, fashion community is concerned because I've seen a lot of videos on like the coach like the puffy tabby uh, purse well if you're new to my channel just want to preface this by say I'm not really a purse girl I like shoes so most of the content that you see of unboxings are usually shoes uh, because those are the things that I like to buy because that's something that I feel like shoes you can wear every day and they just make an outfit a little bit better jazzy it up a little bit so that's why I like shoes I don't necessarily have to wear a purse every day I have my little Louis Vuitton card holder and that's something I usually slip in a pocket or you know that sort of thing it's not something that I feel like okay I need to have a purse because it's just too much stuff to keep up with when you have a purse then it just keeps junky and that sort of thing so today's unboxing is shoes be sure to watch the entire video make sure that you like you comment subscribe if you like what you see if you don't that's cool i understand that as well and then uh, for all of my new subscribers i just want to thank you thank you thank you for joining the group okay joining for you just subscribing to my channel i want to thank you guys and then just people that have been subscribing thank you thank you thank you i appreciate it i really do appreciate it um so let's go into what I got from coach so if you've seen my previous video before this one when I showed the Sophia Webster shoes that I ended up taking back to the store because I didn't like how my foot sit like right at the back of the shoe I like to have a little bit of room when I'm wearing slides I don't want to feel like I'm trying on my little sister's shoes okay so I said when I go to the store I'm gonna take these back and I'll look and see what's around, but I, that doesn't mean I'm gonna necessarily buy anything. And that was my thing. I'm not gonna necessarily buy anything. I'm just gonna look around and if I see anything. Well, I seen these coach shoes uh, my last trip when I showed you guys the Neiman's uh, sale, the Neiman Market sale. I sh said that I seen these shoes that I really liked. And I don't like to just go ahead and bite the bullet. I always like think about a shoe unless I know that I really wanted it. Like I always like to think about it and make sure that I have stuff to wear with it that it will go that is something I really like um, before I just bite the bullet and buy things because that's how you just accumulate so much stuff and you don't really even use it and I'm really like that like a spare of the moment type of girl I typically like that I'll just pick up something if I really really like it like if I know I really really like it then I'll just pick it up but then sometimes I regret that I picked that up so I'm trying to make more conscious decisions and not just overload myself with tons of things and so when i seen these shoes i was like i don't know they were a good price like only 70 bucks and so i was like okay i like them but am i just buying them because they're cheap or am i buying them because i really like them so um what i decided was i was going to go back to the store and try them on because they had a nine and a half and a ten and i was thinking i really need a nine and a half and then when I tried back on the nine and a half and like a pink color that they had, I was like, nope, my foot sits right at the back. I don't know why I like the nine and a half, but I think I liked it because of how tight it was around the front. The 10 gave me more room, but was a little uh, looser across the top. So I decided to just get the 10s and bite the bullet. So let me share the shoes. I think I've been talking enough. So I'll just share the shoes with you so you can see them. So I got them in this little, coach bag they gave me and it's cute the little handles and stuff it's really cute i've shopped at like the coach outlet before um i don't think i've ever bought anything in the coach store so here's the shoes and it's called the essie leather sandal the colorway is called natural and i got a size 10 okay so i'm just gonna open it up they have like this little plastic thing that goes around the shoe just to keep the box top on and then you open it up has a little coach like footwear care booklet to like show you how to take care of it and then if we unwrap it here's the shoes so i knew i liked these shoes after i had seen them i had went to i was getting dressed in the morning 
uh, for work. And I was like, ooh, those one shoes would have went really good with them. So then I was like, okay, I have something to wear with them. I was thinking about these are what I should have worn. So I was like, let me just get the shoes. So here they go. They're really cute. You see how it has like the C right here for coach? Okay, and then it um, has this little other thing across. I like them because um, if you're just looking at them like face down and stuff, you wouldn't be able to tell that they were a coach shoe. Um, so I really like that about it. It is also leather. Let me get the other one out. It's also leather as well. So I really like that aspect about it. And then this is like just the canvas, um, canvas soles. And it's really soft. So let me show you. They're really cute. It's really soft on the inside bedding part of it. Like these are a really comfortable shoe just to like slide your feet in and that sort of thing. I will show you these with me wearing them. Um, so you'll see me wearing them in a clip. But they're very, very cute and simple and chic. And they kind of remind me of um, the Oran sandals by Hermes. Uh, and the reason why, just because they're a simple, clean shoe, um, it doesn't have like too much going on. And like I said, you wouldn't really, really be able to tell that it's like a coach shoe when your foot is actually all the way in it. I just really like the look of it. I seen another shoe that kind of does something like this. Like I think it's the Chloe shoe. I think Chloe has a shoe that looks similar to this. And also, Jimmy Choo has a shoe that looks, that kind of wraps two things like this too. But I just like the simplicity of the shoe. Um, that is just leather, a leather sole, and that the canvas bed is really, really soft. You see all like the coach going down here, and then that is the coach C. I really like it, I think it's cute. And then this is just the back. It has a little coach and the little coach, coach thing chariot coach and then it says coach on the little bottom heel and all this is like a rubber a rubber bottom and then the leather which these would be good sandals too to take like to the beach and stuff like that i'm thinking when i go on my trip i'll probably bring these sandals especially if they wear pretty well so i'll probably bring these these are a good like shoe when you want not to do a lot but do do something like i really like these shoes as opposed to like some of my glittery jelly shoes that I like to wear. Not jelly, but you know, some of my glittery sparkly shoes. These are a nice alternative to that. And they go with anything. Like what I'm wearing today, I could wear these. Whatever I'm wearing, I can wear this. I wear a lot of like tans and browns and whites and blacks. So this would just like set it off even more. So I really like these shoes. They are clean, basic shoes. So when I went back into the store, of course, I couldn't just get one pair. I decided that I'll just get the other pair. And they have these in three colors. They have them in black, they have them in the natural color, and they have them in pink. So what color do you think I got? Put it down in the comments box. What's the other color you think I got? Cause you know if I like something, of course I'm gonna double up on it if I really, really like it. And it's a good price. I won't just say if I really, really like it. If it's a good price too. Or if I feel like it's worth it. So in the comments box below, tell me what you think I got? Okay. So the other color that I got was same thing like in the other one has this. I got black. <laughs> so I decided to get the black pair as well. They're cute too. I really, really like the natural color. It just blends in really good with my skin tone. So that's why I like it. But the black is very cute too. And the black has the black coach in the inside versus like the tan has like a gold coach in the inside. You see that? But shoes very similar. The soles on the bottom of this is black. Then these have like the tan to just make it look more seamless. I really like how they like paid attention and did that to the shoe just to keep it like really clean and crisp. Same thing, very cushiony. Let me show the other one. Okay. And there they go. Both, both of the, like the two little C's put together. Very, very nice little shoe like i'm excited that i just went ahead and purchased them i'm still kind of second guessing getting the black because i don't know if i like it like it but i'm gonna try to wear it around and see how i feel about it like just try to throw it on with some of my outfits and see if i really like how they look but i do like them and i will show them on my feet as well 
So check that out just so you can see how they look. They're very cute. They do have these. Uh, these were on 30% off. So they're originally $100. They're 30% off. So I got them for $70. Um, online, the only color they have last time I checked was a pink color. It's only in a size 6. I will link it in the box below just for your reference if you want to see it and just get all like the specs of the shoe. But what I recommend, recommend if you want to get this shoe, if you have a coach store next to you, like go to the coach store and ask them about the shoe. It's called the, I think SE, yeah, SE leather sandal. So ask about the SE leather sandal. What they can do is they can look it up and find it in another store if they don't have it in their store. So right now it would be basically you just grabbing shoes from other stores. When I talked to the sales associate at the boutique that I went to, she basically said if it's not online for us to order then mostly it's just in stock at the stores and you would just have to call around but was very like friendly and like i can call another store i know when i first came in earlier that week they called another store for me in texas and they had the shoes there and they could have just purchased it over the phone but i was like let me just wait and see and make sure that i'm making the right purchase and so that's kind of where I was with it. and But they are very helpful. Well, the sales associates that I had were very helpful. And every, every time I went in to coach, um, the sales people have been very, very helpful. So I would say check it out if you're interested in these shoes. They're well worth it. They're well made. I'll just show them to you again. Like they're just very like a seamless, timeless shoe that I can wear season after season. Like even if I get old and I stop liking sparkles, I can still put these shoes on as long as they're in good condition, which I'm sure they will be because I have so many sh sandals now to like flip through that I need to start getting rid of stuff. So I'm probably gonna start putting things on my Poshmark so that I can get rid of some of my older sandals and just upgrade to new things instead of just keeping things so cluttered, okay? So that's really all I have for this video, you guys. I want to thank you if you watched this long. Hopefully, um, you enjoyed the content. Um, in the comments box below, just let me know which shoe do you like better. Do you like the tan shoe or do you like the black shoe? Let me know. Um, and then if you're new to my channel, thank you, thank you, thank you just for staying this far to watch. Hopefully, you'll consider subscribing. I want to thank you guys. Um, who have been helping me grow my channel. I appreciate it. Like I am definitely on um, this YouTube journey and trying to like push out content for you guys. I'm really, really gonna try to film my vacation vlog. If even if I just have to shoot one at a time each day and upload it, I'll do something like that. But I'm really gonna try to shoot my vacation because I missed like two or three vacations I was trying to film for you guys. And I just was like, I'm not having it. So <laughs> I'm gonna try to push through. So if you wanna see some vacation content, I'm gonna be on the beach in a nice little hotel. So if you guys wanna see that, let me know below and I'll make sure I post um, some of my travel stuff. And that's really all. Just thank you guys for watching my channel uh, because you could have been anywhere else, but you decided to be here and I appreciate that. I hope you guys have a good night, a good morning, a good evening, whenever you're choosing to watch this video. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.